Hello guys, dear students, welcome to uh, another video in Schools of Linguistics. Today we'll be talking about Greek linguistics. This is uh, lesson number six. Traditional linguistics goes back to the Greek philosophers of the 5th uh, century BC who considered the grammar as a branch of philosophy. They were concerned with the written language as the term grammar, meaning the art of writing in Greek indicates. So basically Greek linguistics uh, were uh, or was interested in, in uh, grammar, okay? And it considered it as a branch of philosophy. Okay, they recognized that language involves regular patterns and attempted to deal with them in systematic way. They studied topics such as the origin of languages. Okay, so they recognized that language involves regular patterns. So what they found out that the languages, they have some regular patterns, which are, or which, uh, which are, you know, the, the, these regular patterns work in a systematic, systematic way. So they try to analyze them, okay? And they study also topics like the origin of language. Okay, so if they, if they know the, if the, the attempt in describing languages results in uh, what's, for example, what, what are those uh, systematic uh, patterns of language, they could, you know, find out that this, the, the similarities between languages and the origin of language, etc. The Greek philosophers discovered the parts of speech, nouns, verbs, particle, article, pronouns, prepositions. So they were the first to 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 describe and come up with these these grammatical notions. So Plato was the first to distinguish nouns and verbs on logical grounds. Aristotle added to this distinction uh, another set. Of that uh, the conjunction okay he also argued for the existence of tense in the Greek verb so this is was like one of the maybe the first scholar of linguistics okay so this is was like the emergence of linguistics okay and it emerged basically in in Greek so this is the the emergence of what is a noun what is a verb okay and then uh, Aristotle he also talked, they added this, uh, this section of conjunctions, okay, he found out that there is a tense in Greek's verbs. Uh, uh, Dionysius Frax discovered the uh, categories of adverbs and participles, pronouns, articles, etc., and prepositions. So, they were like uh, these, ling these linguists were one after the other adding and discovering uh, some basic notions in, uh, in grammar. Thank you very much for your uh, attention. This was the first School of Linguistics, uh, 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 Greek Linguistics, and I hope you enjoyed and learned from this video. Catch you guys in the next one.